I am Frank Biggs with B Young RV in Milwaukee, Oregon, the greater Portland metro area. And today I'm going to show you this brand new 2013 Tiffin Motorhome Allegro Breeze 28 footer. This is the shortest motorhome in their line. And this is a diesel pusher. And before I show it to you, I think I should take you on a test drive first. This is powered by a Max Force 7. It's a V8 uh, diesel engine. This is a diesel pusher. And we have 240 horses and 620 foot pounds of torque. This engine's been uh, boosted up in 2013, so this is the first 28-footer uh, with the new uh, engine performance package. And I'm telling you, this is gonna be like driving a Mercedes-Benz. Bob Tiffin, uh, he actually designed this so his wife could uh, uh, drive a diesel pusher. And uh, so it's on the Power Glide chassis, the same chassis that goes on the $400,000 plus uh, Tiffin buses, Allegro buses. This thing is sweet. <laughs> I better be careful. The wife will want to buy one of these and trade in the other motorhome. I love it. Now I'm getting ready here to do a zero to uh, 45. I'm actually going to time how long it takes. I don't like I do a rolling start, but uh, I was in second gear there, so you'll have to forgive me. 19 seconds. I'll probably stick with the legal speed limit. I've hit uh, 50 miles an hour in 27, but I want you to remember I started in second gear because I was doing a rolling start. But we're rolling through here. This is a, uh, there actually used to be a, a railroad that went through here, so this road is kind of lumpy up and down. But I'm staying between the yellow and white line right now. All right, let's go back to the park down along the river, and we're gonna do a walk around and. Check it all out. Hi, wasn't that fun? That was a blast. This is full body uh, paint. This is the silver sand. Uh, there's two coats of clear coat on here. When you feel this, you won't feel any edges. Cargo doors, notice the big heavy doors here. Chain on here so you don't break the pistons. Then I can slam this door. Electronic components down in here. You like these side open doors instead of the lift up doors. It's got central back in it. Furnace is on this side here, suburban furnace. This will be access to the water tank and uh, your full filtration water system in here. Back of the reefer, aluminum wheels, Michelin tires. The hitch is rated from 4,000 pounds. You got the seven way bargeman. Of course, you've got the backup camera integrated in the one-piece cap back here. With Tiffins, you're going to have a one-piece cap forward and aft uh, on all their motorhomes. And you do have a real fiberglass roof up on top, which is a molded fiberglass. And it actually has walkways on both sides of the air conditioners. By the way, I said air conditioners. On this 28-footer, we have two ACs. One is a 15,000 BTU with a heat pump, and the other is a 13.5. You'll notice the exhaust pipe here. This has 2,700 miles as it came from Red Bay, Alabama. Uh, very, there's no soot in here. This is how it came. Uh, because we're gonna use the DEF fluid in here, which is, I believe in the DEF fluid, what it allows is less emissions, and uh, they burn off on the afterburner side, and uh, the, the engines burn cleaner and, and run quieter. We are only 28 feet, so your service panel for your uh, Sewer hookup and water hookups will be underneath the slide. Usually you'll do that before you uh, uh, put the slide out. And that is a heated, uh, these coaches are designed to go below to zero degrees when you're running the propane heat. Look how smooth this is, nice graphics, huh? There'll be some more access to the, this propane will be down here, of course. This goes to the other side, you do have pass-through storage. Um, Tiffin does give you some extra tiles in case you uh, uh, ruined one inside from dropping a knife or somebody had their uh, golf shoes on where they can use spikes still. All right. Now I want to talk about the slide. This is really significant because nobody else in the industry does. This is a seamless slide. This is all molded as one piece. 
you know, where most slides have, uh, and that'll be the, the way it goes with Tiffin on all their motorhomes in the future, but we're gonna do this first on the breeze. But look at that, we're not gonna have water leaks or anything with it, one piece. Anyway, you got a slide topper on top. They'll have another service panel, uh, electronics are in here, part of them. Typical on a diesel. Nice big mirrors close to the side here. Driver can see easy through the window. Sideboard cameras are still down here on the uh, breeze. And we have access to the generator from down here. It'll be an Onan Cummins 6000. It is a diesel generator, not a propane generator. The Tiffin is the quietest motorhome there is in all North America. All right, I think it's time to check out the inside. All right, we're going to quickly talk about the front dashboard here. Of course, uh, we have uh, the camera with sideboard cameras, your air conditioner, your DVD player, easy access up here in the dash with the uh, transmission. This is your HWH computerized. Um, when I level it, I would uh, dump the bag and then hit level, and it'll automatically level the coach when you're in a park. Um, anyway, it's all got everything, and anybody can drive this. We do have adjustable pedals here, and the steering wheel will tilt. Okay, and it'll also telescope. Uh, both driver and uh, passenger do get six way uh, power seats in here. Uh, these are flex steel chairs. This is all ultra leather that's in here. We have a uh, couch here. This is a jackknife sofa that's going to flatten out. You pull the blosters out and do that. Uh, we have solar shades here with the MCD shades and uh, night shades. This happens to be in the Stonehenge fabric. And we have the ivory cream uh, decor in here, which we haven't had one of these for about three years. Hard to come by. Uh, it really brightens it up. Now we're in the kitchen. We're going to have the Avalar. Uh, countertop here, solid surface countertop and industrial grade. And we got the uh, dual stainless steel sink. And I have to tell you, it was one of my customers that went to one of the shows and walked up to Bob Tiffin and says, We need double sinks, not a round sink. And he goes, Will you buy it if you uh, do that? And they go, Yes. And since then, we've had double sinks in here, and it's great. Uh, you have a two burner uh, count, uh, cooktop up here, the high output, lower one. Remember, this is a compact. Uh, Diesel pusher, and so you can use that for countertop. We've got nice roller bearing guide drawers through here. Uh, place for a garbage can, which came with the coach. Uh, convection microwave in here. This has not been unpacked. We barely had this on, at the dealership. So we swing over to this other side. We do have some new pantry in here. Nice. Uh, Eight cubic foot refrigerator with an ice maker. I have a high speed fan above me in the kitchen. There's another TV over here on this side. This is a standard TV that comes with it. And we have a sofa here with seat belts, your table, and when you're traveling, you can fold the table over. And that's solid wood. Again, the ultra leather cup holders. Uh, you'll have LED lights in the overhead uh, roof here. Again, we have two ACs on here with a heat pump. as uh, a forward one. This is your intake. Instead of having a big box up here that you see and it's noisy, uh, your intake is on the uh, driver's side all the way down the coach. It's quieter. And this is where your AC is going to come out of is on this side. Very efficient. And in addition to this TV, we have two more. But I have one up in the front there. And you'll notice it's on two different channels right now. I can have all three channels going. I can have the DVD player working on one of them because we have repeaters in here. So I can watch the DVD up there with one. I have one control to operate in here for a full surround home entertainment center. And it's all Panasonic. That's all that Tiffin uses. Light switches, your control for your uh, air conditioning and your heat is right here. I got a nice pocket door here to shut it off. A little translucent. Nice and bright in here. On this side, I'll have the shower. It will be a one-piece shower stall, not two-piece. And there is a skylight in there, nice and bright inside the shower. On this side, solid door. 
I'm going to have a nice bathroom and on the right hand side I'm going to have the solid surface countertop again with a single oval seat, a Mullen faucet, towel holders, and I have a nice big toilet in here. In the bedroom here we have a nice pocket or pocket door here with translucent and it snap locks in place. Uh, this is a uh, 60 by 75 inch bed in here. Uh, remember this is only a 28 foot motorhome. We got nice three nice drawers down in here on this side. You got a, a stand here. You do have a little closet up in here and you got a wall plug here in case you need it. Uh, some Panasonic speakers up in here, light control here and then of course the overhead. All right the TV is no longer on the wall it's in the overhead up here and again it's going to be a Panasonic TV not an off-brand and we got pistons holding it down and you can actually see it from the bed sorry I didn't turn it on for you but like I said again we can have three different channels uh, you can have the satellite dish on and watching satellite DVD whatever um, and there's a USB port here so if I'm in here and I want to watch a series of uh, camera pictures I can do that and then it just folds right back up we lock it in place and we're set. We're down here at Mildred Bar in uh, Clackamas County. This uh, uh, a county park is one of the finest. It's huge. Again, let's get back to the motorhome. Uh, this Tiffin Breeze here, uh, your Panasonic uh, DVD player is in the back back here. Uh, but again, we have repeaters on the TVs. So once you load whatever your DVD, Blu-ray, you can watch it uh, from any TV with just uh, using your hand control. No more having three or four hand controls to operate TVs in a motorhome. Another closet. We do have another uh, control here because we have separate controls on the air conditioning and heat because we have zone heating in here. And you'll notice that we have a tile floor through here. Uh, the tile uh, is all the way through the coach. No rugs in here. Each of those squares are individual and those squares are put on their own flooring and then that flooring is put on another flooring and below that is another flooring so this will be the quietest coach you've ever driven and uh, this is a lot of fun to drive and you've already experienced that this flex steel is pretty comfortable i have to admit again this is frank biggs with b young rv in milwaukee oregon the greater portland metro area in oregon in the pacific northwest I welcome you to come down to the dealership and check out the Breeze and or any of the other Tiffins that we have. Right now we have a pretty good selection. We've been selling an awful lot of them. But we also sell towables, including travel trailers, uh, uh, big fifth wheels, and we even have some small hybrids and we have some, uh, you know, we even have teardrops there. But anyway, we're a full service dealership and uh, again we belong to the priority rv dealer network so you have dealers across the united states that'll take care of if you had any service issues but i welcome you to come down and have some fun at b young rv that's what it's all about at b young rv is to have fun thank you